Hello guys, and this is Jay Gore Off, and today so we are playing more Totally Accurate Battle Center. I'm just loving this game, and so are you guys. I'm going to do more modifications and mods today, and I think you guys will like it. I've had a couple I've been picking and stuff, and as you see right here, this is an example of a boring one. This weird guy who can just knock down people. Yes, I call this boring. But this is actually funny. Just balloons and giant mans, I'm going to call this. Bombs, balloons, whatever. But I love this thing. Just giants, bombs, balloons. This one I really like. Just the explosions he's getting grabbed onto. And like all the balloons, the guys start flying out of nowhere. And then, like, he falls on them. He's like, oh, what the heck just now happened? Just look at him. The goodly I figured be like, I don't know. And then he's like, ooh. And he's like, oh, wah. He's like, ah. Just look at his eyes. Oh, my God, that explosion was huge. Guys are on fire there. Just, if you notice, like, everybody catches on fire here. Like, my guys are so bad, they're just in slow motion, if you notice, my guys are so behind this guy. Just they grab on these our guys, like, they have, like, the weirdest design, the balloon guys, and with bombs. But, like, if you notice, like, his legs are just, now just moving back, and then, like, my guys are just being lazy and be like, oh, ah. And then, like, they're just walking forward, and they don't care about him. And then, like, I don't get it, but everybody just dies, and they all grab onto him. Like, and they all head up into the air. <sighs> oh, my God. That's, like, the dumbest idea ever. Oh, my God. I don't know what they were thinking or why. And then more explosions. I don't know if my guy survived that or why. But that was awesome. And then there's that guy in the right who was on fire. Okay, now some more Egyptian style things. Okay, I like the pyramid one, say. And this is going to be really cool, this one. There's two catapults, a couple arrows here, a lot of arrows, actually. A couple mummies, just... For Egypt. Okay. The mummies. And also there's knights. There's shields. There's a throne. This is interesting. That one side. And then there's a vehicle. It's in the future away. On the other side. The, they have like a futuristic version of. Like. The. Like catapult the cannon. Just. The can's going to possibly win the other team at, but this is going to be interesting. A modern versus past, like gun versus no guns. Just this is going to be interesting. There's going to be a huge explosion on the pyramid, possibly. If I end up ruining history here, just I don't care. Nobody likes history anyways. Okay. So... I'm going to say you start this. Okay. Now, to be honest, guns are going to probably win. Even though they are getting help from the things that block it and stuff, I'm going to, of course, win. I'm going to think I'm going to need to re-advance my technologies here. So, oh my god, that guy's butt is stuck in... Yes, we are taking over, and I feel the feeling of being a bad person. Let's suck them in with that. Oh, my God. I'm an awful person in the future. Oh, my God. Red obviously won. With their guns and stuff, their futuristic lasers, and a lot of other things. Just because, like, you have a bigger amount of people doesn't mean you always win but this was interesting there the mummies survived for long okay let's watch this this time there's gonna be a little explosion yes 
so that everybody just, there was an ambush I was thinking of doing, just ambushes everybody loves, and then they're all heated on the ground. Oh my god, that was so unfair, that one. Okay, let's have a ton of guys like this, and we're going to use these, and we do not underestimate the power. Okay, like, I want to see what's under the masks of these guys. But next one, this is um another modification that I'm going to try out that has a cool setting. And I always find these modifications cool because there's many versions of historic things or big just things in pop culture. Snow, I like just, I think there's a Yeti guy that I can use, but I'm going to use guns like to represent... To see, like, futuristic guns versus, like, like the past. And, like, that worked in the snow. Okay. Now let's try them a bit more far back. Because that was unfair. Futuristic guns versus... Oh, my God! Did you see that? They just got took it out in seconds. So it was like, I can defeat you. And then they were like, Jay just fell down. Oh, my God. This is going to be... Another interesting one with cannons and tons of catapults. A lot of cannons. But this is my favorite one that I'm going to be doing today. Because I'm going to be doing it the longest. But it's like Star Wars. If you guys remember why I did the Star Wars deal. I loved that modification. And we're going to have some lightsabers in here. Some of these guns and stuff. This is going to be a long-lasting battle. We are going to win the Rogue One. Okay, let's just place down some guys with um who are on the light side with some lightsabers and Jedi's. Oh my God, Darth Maul is actually doing well. God, this is cool. Just like all of the like cool. Atmosphere around it. I assign this cool. Oh my god. We are the Jedi's, it looks like. And then they're like just doing weird, like, tricks and stuff. Yes, the light side one. This is good. Okay, let's try and get rid of those guys. And just instead of Jedi's, we're just going to try out the guns and see what happens. Like, just the cannons and stuff. Okay, now that we've used up our cannon, now this is trapped, and they've got, whoa, they won. That was interesting. They just came at me there. Okay, so let's try out this modification for now. I've tried it out as many times as possible, and now I figured out it's good, where they just don't get took out at the stern. They fall like dominoes. Okay, so this is going to be exciting. Let's see. Okay. Actually, I need to rethink this. No guns was a bad idea. Just, they're all falling in terror. Now, this is a horror movie. And that guy's just doing nothing. This is not what you do in a war. Now, this was a bad idea. I blame it on Chief, um, I don't know. I, I blame it on Joker. Okay, let's try and hit into them. Okay, that's perfect. Explosions at the start, they all fall. Okay, the big man. Mm. Big man, please survive. I'm gonna need you to survive. It's survival of this. We need to win this war. Oh my god. Thanks, weird snow animals that could just cause Ebola or something. You're helpful towards me. Well, we are insects and they're dead, the chickens. Ch chickens are actually helpful, I learned. Big man, survive! Oh no, he's not going to survive the force. Whoa. How does he have such good footsteps? You should take out your own guy. Oh my god, Red. What was I thinking when I did that? Okay, so let's try out a more nicer grass-looking background here. 
And, like, we're going to go for a bit more fair here. Or we're going to do, like, lightsabers versus guns to see who will win. Oh, I just love lightsabers. But the electricity is the hard part. And the interesting part is all the shields that are happening. This is a pretty even match. Oh, my God. When I say even, just, like, that was interesting, to be honest. Like, hmm. <laughs> Why is Darth Maul win? Darth Maul, you served well with your how you shoot. Just kill them, gun. Oh, no, it may have force field. Force fields are just not helpful at all, to be honest. If I would have a force field as a present, I wouldn't why. It would just break. Have something break through it would be a hard part. Like, these guns are really actually OP. But the lightsabers are yellow. Weird. I don't know what they're thinking when they made lightsabers yellow. Okay. Now this is my favorite one. Interesting. A big man. A ton of Jedi's. Now this area... If anybody gets stuck in anything, it won't be my fault, but they'll get, possibly get stuck in the machines and stuff. But this is going to be awesome. If only there was a Goliath in this level. Like, that would be even more awesome for the battle. Like, this is the ultimate battle of the century. To see. Oh my god, these are the ultimate state-of-the-art guns, and they're just doing horrible. They look so outnumbered, to be honest. The dark side looks very outnumbered in reality. It just looks like a mess now. Red Giant, help! I know that you represent Red Bull, so help! Aw, oh, darn Red Bull fell. Okay. So red and dark side, we need to possibly give them a bit more. Uh, if only we had like a guy that split through bombs here, you know, that wouldn't fit in the setting. Okay, we got these demons hanging all over that I think are awesome. Like I said, I wish there was a Goliath, but these demons are awesome. Like, they can't haunt people. Just with magic. Now these guys I find awesome because they're spells and things. They don't really hurt people and stuff. But they're really cool. Like they're impossible. And they're forced to be wrecking with. Oh my god. There's just. Wh whoever spamming a bunch of gun shots is truly annoying. How the heck do people last in this war? <gasps> He believes that red giants can fly. Demons all survive in the tide. Oh my god, they survived. Okay, that was a nice seconds of magic. Oh, they, oh darn it, the wall fell. Surprising. Now these are my ultimate real team. Because nobody cares about my art teammates. Okay, you're getting stuck in those. Just get in those. Okay. They're, now, these guys are helpful. Stop just throwing around the Kai. These guys have got my of their own. Really. Okay. One's like a real person. It's a good thing. Now, this thing is with witches and things. The cool thing. Just like this level of I really found cool. That was the ultimate fight. How did they win? The little eyeballs won. Now, this is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, they aren't. Just kill the one cannon. Okay. That was interesting, guys. The cannon, they didn't destroy or anything. But still, they end up winning the battle. That's the nice part. But that's going to leave it for this deal. of eyeball fights and stuff and awesome guns, Star Wars, explosions, tall guys, and balloons until you after a battle center. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to Jay Gore. I'll see you in the next video.